Hey guys, welcome back to Bookishly Lauren. Today I'm going to be doing a Star Wars Smuggler's Bounty unboxing. This month's box is Star Wars Rebels. I've never actually seen that show, but I've heard that it's really good. This is probably spoilery. The pin has come loose. And they're playing. Okay, so I set the box down off to the side over here. And the pin is, I believe this character's name is Sabine Wren. I don't know how, how well this is going to focus. Sabine Wren, I believe. I've seen this character target, but I don't know much about her. And here's this month's patch. I'm not sure what this character's name is either, but it looks pretty cool. I like that they include the patches because it's kind of fun to have something that maybe you could put on a jacket later. Or even if you like made a quilt or something, you could put all these patches from the different Star Wars Smuggler's Bounty on them. And it'd be like a little memory. Blanket. All right, so the first thing in there is the spoiler card, which I'm going to put off to the side in just a second, but I'm super excited because next month's theme is Star Wars A New Hope, and I'm expecting there to be some cool Princess Leia stuff, Luke, maybe even Han Solo. That'll be exciting. All right, the next thing in there is a t-shirt. I'm actually wearing a t-shirt I've gotten from my Smuggler's Bounty before. It's one of my favorites. Okay, so here's the t-shirt. It's pretty cool. It's got all the different characters from Star Wars Rebels on it, which again, I have not seen, so I'm not sure who they are, but I'm excited to watch the show now that I've gotten some merch for it. That off to the side. All right, so the next thing I see in here are two Funko Pops, which I actually collect Funko Pops, so I'm excited about those. Here is the first one. It is Captain Rex, which again, I have no idea who these people are, but they're super cool. And yes, I collect my Funko Pops out of the box. Some people will think I'm a mess for doing so, but I like looking at them. And here's Captain Rex out of the box. He looks really cute. I like him. He has dual pistols, it looks like here. And as always, he's on a Star Wars ace, just like the rest of the Star Wars Funko Pops. And also, excuse my nail polish, I need to redo my nails. Alright, next is the Star Wars Rebels Dark Maul Pop. I knew this was going to be in the box, they actually spoiled it a few months ago on their social medias. Everybody knew they were getting one of these, but nonetheless, he is still pretty cool. And, um, I knew that he was on the show, even though, spoilers, he died in Phantom Menace, or so we thought, I guess. But, you know, I still need to get into this show and figure stuff out. But I haven't seen Clone Wars yet, so I had to finish that show first. Alright, here he is out of the box. He looks pretty cool, he's got all his little on his head there and his dual sided lightsaber. Pretty awesome pop. Alright, last thing in the box is a Hikari Mini of Chopper, which I'm not sure who Chopper is because, like I said, I have not seen the show, but he's still pretty cool. I love the Hikaris. I'm not a huge collector of them, but they're cool to have. Alright, so that was my Star Wars Rebels Smuggler's Bounty unboxing. I hope you enjoyed. Thanks for watching and like and subscribe.